Backstage secret. What is it? Like, what do you mean? Everybody has backstage secret But thoughts. they wouldn't be secret if I... The secret is that there's way less going on backstage than you would think. Personal questions. I pick those to you ask pick you. pick those to ask me. And the white ones are me asking you. You have the nicer color. I'm oh. a little jealous. <laughs> and these questions are general questions. For the both of us. There will be joker questions. So I can make up my own question and ask you whatever. You understand? Yeah, yeah I got it. <laughs> Let's start it. If you win the lead singer of The Hives, which band would you choose to be lead singer of? Uh, once when ACDC's frontman couldn't do a tour anymore, I try, we just have been on tour with them and I asked if I could replace him. So I think I'd pick ACDC because when I was six years old, that was the first rock band I liked. You liked them? Oh. It's the reason I'm in a rock band, I think. <laughs> yeah, it's So I, ACDC. Is it, this is great. It great is. answer. I agree. Thank you. How did discovering the drag queen inside you change your life? Oh my God. I think uh, since a child, I feel um, a special and feel the energy. And when I discovered drag and oh, the whole world of possibility that I can be, it's very important to me because giving me voice, giving me power. Mm -hmm. And yeah, since a child, I know that. Uh, something in my life it's gonna change someday and and this is it yeah this is it yeah cool it's a very impressive what song is your guilty pleasure guilty pleasure yeah i love guilty pleasure i i mean i love guilty pleasure so much that they're not even guilty i just i'm just happy if i like something yeah i don't really feel guilty about it but i, I guess there's stuff that other people don't think i would like that i do like uh one of my favorite records is uh I think this guilty pleasure is not guilty pleasure because all the songs, uh, if make you happy, is great. Yeah, know? it's like, well, there's no problem with that. I think what people would be most surprised is that one of my favorite records is like, there's like a Belinda Carlisle album called Runaway Horses. It's <laughs> one of know. my favorite albums. It's really old. Yeah. It's not, I mean, yeah, it's really old. It's like from when I was a kid, kind of like when Madonna was popular and stuff. Cute. Kind of from that, I guess like from 19... 88 or something. What's your favorite guilty pleasure? I, I, it's not guilty pleasure, but my friends always, when I heard a song, tell me, Betch, why you listen to that? You know, um, the future is called Downtown by Petala Clark. You know Petala Clark? Oh, yeah, it's great. I love that Downtown. song. Downtown. I love this Isn't song. Isn't that like a big, it's like a drag hit? Yeah. Yeah, a lot of people do. I that. love this yeah, song. It I makes me feel too. cool. The city. I had another guilty pleasure that was that I actually kind of did feel guilty about. Mambo number five. <laughs> it's a great. It's good, yeah. It's a great. Mambo that's actually a little embarrassing, so that's yeah. guilty, I guess. Would you share a backstage secret with us? Backstage secret? Uh, what is it? Like, what do you mean? Everybody had backstage secrets. But they wouldn't be secret if I. The secret is that there's way less going on backstage than you would think. <laughs> I, I have my secret, I love to do squats before my performance. Okay, is that you good? You know, being... <laughs> <laughs> I understand. Maybe it helps. Yeah. Okay, now it's my turn. Last question? Mm, yeah. Are you ready, Pablo? Always ready. Top or bottom? Versace. You understand? I don't understand. Girls, be on the scoop. Can you explain it now? <laughs> Top or bottom? Yeah. You I, don't know. Yeah, you yeah, don't... yeah, I know what that is. Versace, do both. Oh, yeah, 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 nice. <laughs> Got it. <laughs>